Hello, lovely people. Okay, um, so in the superfoods program, uh, one of our hero ingredients is tofu. Let's just kind of have a little chat about it. Um, I challenged 15 today to make me a nice fresh lunch um, with tofu, but this has literally been dressed in soy, little lime juice, little rapeseed oil, lovely herbs, loads of veggies, and it's delicious. Very, very simple way to do it. Um, but give it a chance, guys. So where should we start? Nutritional, okay. Um, tofu is fantastic. It's absolutely full of so many good things. Of course, it's made from soya beans, uh, although you can make it with other beans. Uh, and beans, as we know, are fantastic for us. Uh, it's a really good source of protein. Um, so in 100 grams of tofu, about 8.5 grams of protein is fantastic. A woman needs about 45 grams a day. So really, really important, especially if you're vegan or vegetarian, okay? because uh, that protein often comes from meat and fish. Um, it's absolutely riddled with great things like calcium and phosphorus, brilliant for bone health. So really, really good in that sense as well. There's a whole load of macronutrients as well, and I could kind of give you a long list, like thiamine, manganese, and stuff like that, and say what they do, but generally speaking, good body health. So let's get on to sort of um, the cooking and the emotional stuff. 15, maybe 20 years ago, tofu, a meat replacement. Okay, you've ruined it already, guys. It's not a meat replacement, okay? It really isn't. The Japanese have been making tofu for God knows how many years, okay? It's an artisanal, incredible thing in its own right. You've got the soft, silken um, tofu. Um, this is shiny and smooth and delicious. And then if you keep pressing it and squeeze out more kind of, um, of the liquid, um, you get something that can be pressed into something more um, condensed and with more kind of texture. This is better for sort of cooking and stir frying. It's a brilliant carrier of flavours. So whether they're mild, subtle flavours, delicate, delicious, uh, or really pungent, strong, you know, curry pastes, um, sort of fermented flavours like miso and stuff like that, it can handle it. A few recipes, um, I want to put you some links to. Amazing, when you whiz up tofu, silken tofu, um, you can make, it's a very clean base. Um, to really good chocolate. It makes a spectacular chocolate pot or, mu uh, or mousse. So click the link below um, and check out the recipe. It couldn't be simpler. I'm talking about a two minute recipe, guys, that will, if you get good chocolate, it will blow your mind, texturally and flavor wise. And it's also vegan friendly as well, which is great because normally mousses would have a load of cream. Also, I've done a really delicious veggie burger, which is really, really fun in my new book, Jamie's um, Everyday Superfoods. So I'll put a link to that as well. And then the lovely um, uh, girl Pooh, she has done a lovely stir fry with tofu that I'll do a link to because that's what she uses every day uh, back home. Um, so check out her recipe as well. So that's it. Big love. If you've got great ideas with tofu, if you love it, uh, then, then put it down in the comments box below. Little things, the little quirky things that make us want to use it and love it. And it should be celebrated with just being an all round brilliant, healthy, delicious food. Uh, but like any food guys, like any meat, any fish or anything, it needs love, care, attention, a little restraint and good taste. Okay, and then you'll be laughing. Anyway, over and out, now for my lunch. Bye.